What is up guys, Grenader here, and today I'll be showing you the best guy to go to if you ever need an intro. So, what an intro is, is basically the intro to your video. It shows people the quality of videos you'll be uploading. So if they see a shitty intro, they're not gonna, you know, watch your video. They're gonna instantly know, dude, if he has a shitty intro, he must have a shitty video. So, this guy will got, well, damn it, I can't talk. Anyways. This guy will get your back. He has your back. So don't worry about that. Some of us can't edit. Some of us can, but don't choose to. Or some of us just, I don't know, just can't. So anyways, I'm going to show you guys the best guy to go to. His name is TFT Creative. He is the best guy to go to. He uploads free templates for everybody. And most of them are freaking awesome. So I'm going to show you guys um, an example of one. And so since I'm doing a Minecraft series, I might just use this one. So... Here it is. Here's the video. Squirrely. Sorry if it's uh, it's a bit laggy. My computer's a bit slow. And kapam. And that's pretty much it, guys. So that's the intro. And so once you choose your intro, you're gonna go into his description, and then you're gonna go down where it says project file. You're gonna click on that. Just wait for this stupid ad to go away, and then click um, download or skip. I think it says skip. Hang on. Uh, come on, come on. There we go. It says skip ad. And then it'll take you to the um, download. Um, it's a Mediafire download, so it's clean of viruses, so don't worry. And so all you got to do now is just drag it onto your desktop and then just uh, start opening it. So before we open it, I want to just let you guys know he has a website. This dude has a website. He is dedicated to upload templates. So this guy is really awesome. Um, I have a link to his channel in the description below, so if you want to go check him out, which you should, um, just click that. And so anyways, I'm going to show you how to edit it. So what you want to do is right click extract and make sure you have the folder from the zip file. You want to double click that and double click that and make sure to, uh, if, he doesn't, if he only has one for CC, don't use it if you have CS6. If he has one for CS6 and you have CC, don't use it. It's not going to work. It's incompatible. So choose the one that's right for you. So here, as you can see, I already have this one up. So I'm going to use CS6 because it's my favorite. I have both CC and CS6, but I choose to use CS6. That's a lot of CCs. You understand? Yeah, yeah, CC. All right. Anyways, once this loads, um, I'm going to show you guys exactly how to edit the names and, you know, the text and everything. And some of these are missing stuff because he doesn't include uh, some of the textures and stuff like that. But don't worry. Most of them work, so there's nothing to worry about there. So as you can see here, you know, it starts blue, little round thing, blah, 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 blah. So what you got to look for is uh, he tries to make it easy on you. He tries to uh, uh, make it easy on you by just so like the text is right here. As you can see, there's a text. Um, he tries to make it easy on you by, you know, just actually literally putting where the text is. And so all you got to do is get the damn it, get the text tool and then um, change the text itself. So I'm going to use my name as an example greenader 0001 and so if you have a long name just like mine do not worry i've got you covered all you got to do is control a and that will select everything and then just make it to where it's kind of you know not past it but like just on it so like that and then you want to go down here and then just kind of make it a bit taller not too tall and boom perfect right so now you want to skip over to the part where it's your URL for your channel and then you want to double click where it says link change inside. Double click and it'll take you to this black screen with that and then click on that and now you can change the um, user part to your actual username. So mine is zgreenader0001. So like I said, if it's too big, don't worry, control A and shorten it, make it smaller. Make sure it's not too big because then people aren't going to like that. So make it a bit smaller, a bit bigger right there. And if you want to, you can hold the control key and then just move it. Um, I have no idea what it is for Mac, so I need to get a Mac, guys. I'm sorry. I can't show you guys Mac tutorials. That kind of sucks. So anyways, once you change the text, it's going to work just like if you've, you know, with your name and your text and everything so there's nothing to worry about so after you got all of that crap settled together all you gotta do is go to composition and add to render 
line or queen or cuny or whatever, however you pronounce it. So then after that, you want to go to your best sentence. And after that, you want to copy all my sentence. All right. Um, being serious, copy all my settings. Um, I have some of the fastest settings out in the world. So why do you not want any of my settings, bro? So here we go. Just save it wherever you want to. Um, it has to be an AVI, so you can't really change that at this point and then change it to whatever I'm going to do test or text whatever um, I'll do that so um, I can't oh yeah desktop double click that there we go now I can save it on, on my desktop and like I said before you can't change it right there but if you go over here to output module and not output to in the module you can actually change it so what you want to change it to is h.264 that is the Kai that yeah. <clears throat> that is the highest quality you can get. Sorry, guys. I sometimes step on my own throat when I get excited. Excited, excited. Anyways, um, copy these settings right here. Hi, and then 5.1. Copy these settings, and then you'll have an easier life. So after that's done, you click on that, and boom, you're done. So what you want to do is hit the caps key or the caps lock. And then that will stop your video from rendering with it. So that way it'll render faster. So just click OK and just let that load and it'll ding when it's done. So actually, as you can see right now, it's going pretty fast. You know, usually when you do uh, Adobe um, After Effects and stuff like that, it's really slow. It's really just mm, like go faster. But um, right now, I think it's going pretty fast, you know, kind of decent. So while it's doing that i'll make sure to put the final product in the in the end of the video so what i forgot to mention to you guys is that sometimes his videos um kind of you know don't work with the intro or the outro because um this video i have the video now but where's the music where's the sound um guys i can't really do anything about that but i have a solution so I know that was kind of like contradicting, but I have a solution to your problem that I told you you had. So yeah, that's pretty weird. So anyways, as you can see right here, uh, TX or whatever, I'll show you a little clip of it. And come on, open up. So as you can see, the sound is up, but you hear nothing because there's nothing there. But as you can see, boom, 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 boom. And then after that, it's going to be like, mm -hmm, boom, grenades are on at your service. So after that's there, all you got to do is go back to the video you clicked on originally. And you go there. And as you can see, the video is right there. So some of you are going to be like, where's the sound? Where? Okay. Here's the sound, all right? Control A, or shit, I already did that. Control A, Control C, and that will copy it. And you need to copy the link and then head over to flvto.com. Link to that in the description below also. And uh, this will send you to this YouTube media converter. And this will actually convert the video into a sound file. And so he doesn't have an intro, which is amazing because it doesn't interfere with it. And so all you got to do now is just wait. I don't want to help you at all. And just let it load. And there you go. Boom. It's done. After that, you click on download and it's going to download right here. And then most of you have Camtasia or Camtasia, whatever you want to call it. And so all you got to do or you don't even need that. If you have Sony Vegas, just edit these two. So uh, for time's sake, I'm just going to do Camtasia real quick because it's a bit faster. And then um, after that, I'll be sure to show you guys the final product. So, ah, man, you guys, I get really excited sometimes. And I just stutter so much when I get excited. Man, you should have seen me the other day. I was trying to ask out this one girl and I got so excited. I stuttered and she's like, what are you saying? I was like, hot. All right. So anyway, Anyways, sorry I got onto a tangent or tangent. See, I'm too excited, guys. Too excited. So import your media and make sure to import your video. Where is it? There it is. Um, import that one and also import the sound. And then after that, you just put them together and then you just uh, render it. So um, I'll be showing you guys... Um, in another video the best render settings for Camtasia because yesterday oh my god guys I found the best render settings and you guys won't believe how easy it was to set that up so anyways 
bring over your video and just set it to whatever you want to. Uh, I like to do 1080p. And so all you got to do is stretch it out. It won't be that bad of a quality. Trust me, guys. It's actually good quality. So after that, you just stretch it down or stretch it out. I mean, and then after that, you go and put that on top. And there we go, guys. See, it's even perfect. So as you can see, um, dun, 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 dun. I think the music's going on, but you guys might not be able to hear it. So I'll make sure to fix that. Sorry, guys. Sorry. And so... And so that was pretty much it guys So um, I'll make sure to show you the final, final, final product At the end of this video As an outro, that's an intro So um, also I have I think by now I'll have a link in the description by uh, About this uh, render settings And holy crap guys You're not going to believe this watch I'm going to call it fast i show you guys how fast it renders. So, here we go. It starts out, and holy crap, look at that. It's just picking up the speed, guys. I know it's just like a 10-second clip, but look at that speed, guys. Look, it's almost done. It's still going. It's still going, guys. It's, oh, my God. Oh, my God. So, this is just proving to those people out in the world criticizing Camtasia. I love Camtasia. Screw off. It's amazing. It's amazing. See, it's already done, guys. It's amazing. It's already done. So all you gotta do is go to fast, or I named it fast, and as you can see right here is the clip with the music and everything, guys. So um, that's pretty much it, guys. Thank you for watching, comment, rate, and definitely subscribe to um, FT. I forgot his name. TFT Creative. He is an amazing person. He uploads some of the best content around. So thank you for watching this uh, sort of shout out slash tutorial slash um live commentary thing so thanks for watching and make sure to comment the rate and definitely subscribe to this guy tft creative there we go remember your name buddy um and that's pretty much it guys so thanks for watching and peace shit put that up let's just pretend you didn't see that thing <laughs> thanks for watching comment rate subscribe to tft creative and have a good day peace out <laughs>